my god, the amount of disrespect that I put on Tierra, I take that all back because she got a new outfit and she's out here adventuring with us and she shows more skin than Shnee, so I'm like, booba. She's pretty great though. Now, there was a little bit of an L when she kind of prevented our main character Shin from popping off too hard. I wanted to see him just go all out. I think that's one of the few moments where he genuinely got upset. But, you know, the wife we gotta come in and just kind of stop it. And hopefully, I was hoping. Like, you know how in level 2 cheat, Fenris was like, you know what? Let's fucking go. Yeah, fuck him up. <laughs> fuck him up, master. But then it's like, wait, I don't want Danasama to be, you know, uh, bad. I want him to be kind. And that's kind of what Tierra also wanted. Now, uh, I think we're entering a new place, new arc, trying to find one of our support NPCs who's like apparently like dying. Let's begin today's reaction. Mm. The church is getting attacked this time. The church was not the bandits, of course. Uh, Wilhelm right now is after that guy, the the shitty priest, right? So it's, I would assume that if it, it'd be in their best interest to like stop us from getting there to get the approval. Okay. No episode title? Okay. Certificate. Well, we can cash that in for gold? This is where we part ways with these two? Really? Flag. I like that redheaded right girl. She's hilarious. She's so tiny. But she fucks people up with her fists. Hmm. Hmm. The wagon is not comfortable for Tierra. You want me to be the fucking, you know, butt pillow instead? OP Hadewin Battle Pass Wagon Incoming. Flying horses? <laughs> Have some unicorns like flying, bro. That's kind of fancy. Look at the design. This is staring at us. This Yuzuha can pull it, dude. Let Yuzuha do some goddamn work, dude. All she does is sit on her head. We already have a tamed monster. Yeah, 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 exactly. Oh, this is her pinging us. It'd not be hilarious if Shni. Whoa, if I think that if Shni like um pulled the wagon, it would be fucking hilarious in this made outfit. But it's probably not right, right? Like Shni and Tierra pulling the wagon. Just imagine that idea. Hmm. Now if it was Chain Soldier, it'd be the opposite, and Shin would be the one pulling the wagon. So no more Shni for another episode. I'm just commentating off the enemies that we watched together. These are your fetishes. So they really want Shni, of course. Is she straight up running to Beirun right now? While lifting her mate skirt? While we were in a wagon? So she's gonna run that entire distance? Damn. Can you do that? Can you, can you do that? I mean, we already saw her like run like super fast before, like when we cut off to Wilhelm, but she, you can just eradicate an entire nation? I, I guess you can. Marriage to Shni? 
made her that way as in like what customizing her like assets like her face titties ass the entire model design or, or, or like you know like the stats and like how cracked she is and how valuable she is I, I, which, which one it's kind of toxic bro i don't know it's just like it's, it's the same shit that hodo also did and you know spice and wolf it's like these girls fucking trying to make the guys they like jealous you know and it's just like did i make it jealous it's like yeah it's like oh what is this fucking ntr is <laughs> Holy shit, he's dense. Alright, this is gonna be another fucking dumbass main character that has no idea that everyone around him loves him, right? Oh, great. We had that one episode where we were, like, talking all night before catching up to Wilhelm. And wasn't there, like, romantic intent suggested from both sides? How does he not even understand the jealousy part? <laughs> <laughs> Tearing about to smoke the good good. Are we sharing a bed? Are, 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 are we sharing a bed? Fancy as fuck chandelier. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Same bed. L. I really? Well, no, it, it says them being like embarrassed and saying like both separate beds, but Shini would probably say no, same room. とんだ宿を。ああ。the same thing. She took the other thing off. Room service? Just skip the meal. Oh my god. Dude, the amount of lights, the lines and shading put into this one frame just for her armpits. <laughs> This is why I say the thing, like, Shini is not power creeping Tierra anytime soon, bro. Cause like, Shini is pretty modest and Tierra is just like, everything is out there. We're not, we're not allowed to watch. No peeking allowed. Leave the bath soup in there after for me. Wow, it's so much bigger than mine and so soft. Boing. Boing. What's soft? What's boinging? Guys, I wonder what it is, guys. What's this mountain? Versus Shni! Gee, I wonder who's gonna win! Shni's gonna win. Yuzua just sleeps on her face. I mean, that's- I mean, that placement on the mouth is kinda... Kumi, cool, you know what you did there. Holy shit, she spoke English. Sorry, Japanese for a second. ここをこうしてここに羽を付ければ揺れは抑えられると。これで完了。あとはベアリングを取り付けて終わりだな。金属を加工する生産系のスキルだ。ちょっと応用を聞かせ。<笑> That's what she said. Also, I am the black blacksmith. <laughs> Only me, baby. There's a big beast beside Shni. What's what? What's to the left of her? Did she tame the beast? No way, right? Do you think that beast that she saw in the mountains is something that she tamed so it's gonna pull our fucking wagon? Because we do need a monster or something to pull it, right? Shni definitely did that, right? Because the like, right beside. There's this big thing left to us. It looks more furry, more like soft than before, but like, okay, we'll see. I think she's about to be even more shocked when she sees what's, you know, gonna be driving for us. The smell? What? The presence? Here's a monster. Our wagon puller! 751. 101. What? 
だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。だけ。
not the eagle or the bird. It's like flowers instead. あ。なあ、そら。私はすぐにそばにいるとは限りませんし。この先ティエラが自分で進む道。主従契約を結べばいつだって影をを呼べるからな。頼もしい。けま。Literally she's gonna come running. That's what she did, bro. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. How does she fall so easily when you just the girls just like fold for him just so easily. He doesn't have to do anything. He just exists. Uh, new character. That's a... familiar voice actor. Ain't that Erwin from Attack on Titan? Alright, his little super mini form. Things are Asian here, man. Not sure what the architecture is supposed to be, Chinese or Japanese. And I feel like these instruments are more Chinese influenced than Japanese. <laughs> these are just masks, right? You actual elephant? Turtle people? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So they're actually real. Oh. Oh, is it straight up an elephant and a fucking turtle? And this is Gerard. Yo, I thought that he was like on his deathbed. Like, it's like, oh, is she incoming for me? But he looks pretty decent. And that is today's episode. I'm not sure what to really tell you guys. Today's episode is just like nothing right like what do we really do we had like uh get the wagon there's some fun scenes with tiara and like i guess shini right i guess right a little bit of like romantic bait here and there and then a little bit of a plot of how tiara saved shimmer and now you know they formed a contract and finally we we're at the village where we're supposed to meet gerard but like yeah this episode is like <laughs> we truly ain't do shit <laughs> but hey maybe it's gonna pick up next episode and that's gonna be it for me if you're still here if you didn't enjoy this reaction please like the video check out the other playlist for more content and until next time take care